Ja, hallo und guten Abend bei Handmade hier in unserer Sonderausgabe zu 50 Jahre Sailor. Wir haben hier einen ganz besonderen Gast an der Strippe und zwar den Schlagzeuger, den Grant. Hallo Grant, Good welcome welcome. to the show. Thank you. <lacht> right, well, um, I first met George through a B.A. Robertson, who um, you may remember had a record called Bang Bang. And George was working at the time with Phil. Uh, they were Kiana's picket. And um, uh, Henry was a friend of Phil's. And so we got together. Uh, there were four of us. Uh, we didn't want to have five people. So we didn't want a bass guitar. And so Phil willingly volunteered to play keyboard bass, which worked out. And then um, I think George came up with the idea of the Nickelodeon, which was this sort of strange looking thing that combined two keyboards. Anyway, um, at the time, bands like Genesis were producing very sort of visual, sort of artistic, sort of pop music. And so, as George had written the musical called Sailor the Musical, uh, we all agreed that we would pursue that. And uh, the first album would be all about sailors coming into town and, well, doing what sailors do when they come into town. And uh, so that's how <laughs> that, that worked. And um, in Although I'd been in before, I'd been in bands where I improvised in Sailor. We had no intention of improvising and we, we wanted to play everything perfectly. So every time we played it, we played it the same way. And in fact, it's very interesting because about six months ago, I was looking at a video of us playing at a place, I think, called the Kersal in South End. And we were so exactly like the record playing Girls, Girls, Girls. I thought we must be miming. That and is a fantastic George, concert. That's like yeah. the, the best ever live concert of Sailor ever recorded. Right, that South yeah. End thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And the strange thing is then George just rephrased something that was totally different from the record. And I realized, no, this was live. <laughs> and just I, I felt so proud that we played so close to the record. And therefore, yeah. it's very difficult looking at videos of us to see whether we were miming or not. <laughs> right. OK. Um, Sailor, uh, the first album, was only successful in Holland. Uh, but then when we did the second album, a Glass of Champagne was successful in, in all over Europe. And um, but Girls, Girls, Girls was uh, already released in Holland. And so what happened was that uh, they, the people in Holland started transferring girls to Germany. And so therefore they had to release Girls, Girls, Girls at the same time as Glass of Champagne. And so we're one of the few bands to have two records in the top 10 in Germany at the same time. And again, Indeed, something yeah. that makes me very proud. Very lucky, yeah. but yeah, very proud. <laughs> okay, Fantastic. then the thing I'd love to say is that Sailor changed my life. You know, Sailor gave me the most wonderful life that I would never have had without Sailor. And I will always be grateful to the other members for giving me that opportunity to express myself artistically, but also, you know, to be successful as a musician.